I'm John Hanover, founder and executive director of Roots Elementary. Um, thanks for watching the video. I'm going to show you how our teachers go about scheduling small group instruction using Google Calendar. All right, so if I wanted to schedule a um, small group math, let's say, with my um, guided math group 10, what I would do is first just go to create a new um, calendar invite. Um, invite guided math 10, I'm the first one to pop up. Um, and then I would go to find a time and try to see when all of those scholars are available. Um, and of course, I've chosen to do it on field day, so none of them are available. Let me go to a different day of the week. Um, so here, basically, you can see they've got small group, um, uh, some small group uh, writing here, problem of the day, writing time, everybody's schedule a little bit different. Um, but I can see that all of them have this window free between 9.55 and 10.40. Um, so I can schedule them for any window within that period of time. So um, let's say I want to do it from, do this lesson from 10 to 10.30. So I just click there from 10 to 10.30, check to make sure those times are, are right. Um, I can call the event. Um, uh, let's say I've set up a routine where we do um, fast facts or something like that. Um, so I'll call it fast facts. Um, I can go back to the details to say where it's going to be. The small group math room um, this year was the ash room. And so uh, after the ash tree. And then um, uh, basically when I click save, what this will do is automatically send an invite to all the scholars who are in guided reading group or guided math group 10. Um, and on their calendar, uh, this will show up as a lesson for them to go to, um, and you know, which you can see from our the visual layer that we built on top of Google Calendar to support our younger learners. Um, it will show, there will be a visual lookup that will show them the ash room um, where they need to go. Uh, I could have had an icon that was associated with fast facts and it would show them the icon um, of what they're going to be working on. And then there would be a headshot of me because I was the teacher who sent them the calendar invite. So you just click save and say that, yes, I want to send the invitations. Um, and then that would flow through now to all of their calendars. So, um, and Google's pretty quick. So as long as I did this with um, you know, a couple minutes notice, um, it could flow right through to a scholar's calendar and show them that they, it's time for them to come to the ashroom for fast facts um, instead of work on whatever was next up on their independent work.